YouTube, what's happening? It's Big Dirty back again with another video reaction for you. So I was going over uh, videos on my channel recently and I hear you loud and clear. The top trending video on my channel for the past, I gotta say week, has been The Office. So that's letting me know that you guys wanna see more of my Office reactions. Now to be fair, I haven't uploaded an Office reaction since the end of season one, which was episode six. Um, I believe the title to that one was Hot Girl. As you all know, I took a little time off from uploading. It's time I get back on The Office. So today we're gonna start with season two. Episode one is titled The Dundies. Now off camera, I did rewatch season one so I could kind of catch myself up and re-familiarize myself because I've never seen this series the entire way through. Um, I know the series is over and a bunch of my friends get on my case uh, for not having seen the entire series. But I'm glad to tell you today, we're gonna get right back on The Office train and I'm going to try my best to continue throughout all the way out through season nine so I can get this entire series done and share some laughs with you guys. So guys, if you're ready to dive back into these videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel down below. More importantly, hit that like button for me and make sure your post notifications are on so you know when I post my new office videos, when I post new comedy reactions. And leave your comments down below in the comment section. I've been reading the comments on all my other office videos um, you guys love these reactions, you guys love these episodes, and I'd love to go back and forth and talk with you guys about them. But without any further ado, let's get on into the video. Tonight is the Dundies, the annual employee awards night here at Dunder Mifflin, and this is everybody's favorite day. Everybody looks forward to it because, you know, a lot of the people here don't get trophies. The Dundies, it's such a good like name. Meredith or Kevin. I mean, who's gonna give Kevin an award? Dunkin' Donuts? Plus, bonus. That's fucked up, why you gotta do Kevin like that? So, I, you know, an employee will go home and he'll tell his neighbor, hey, did you get an award? And the neighbor will say, no, man. I mean, I slave all day, nobody notices me. Next thing you know, Employee smells something terrible coming from the neighbor's house. Neighbor's hanged himself due to lack Jesus. of <laughs> <laughs> It's Fat Halpert. <laughs> Brush was so awful. Fat Halpert. Jim Halpert. <laughs> so why don't I have Stanley the Manly? Now, Stanley is a Dundee all star, aren't you saying? Why don't you uh, Stanley. show them some of your bling? I don't know where they are. I think I threw them out. Uh, <laughs> he always ass. keeps it real. <laughs> uh, I think I did. He said, no, you didn't. You know, did. you know what? I wanted one of those skillets of cheese, but when I got off stage, someone had eaten all of them. <laughs> a little bit of oh, no, on a recorder. A little bit. Kevin's wide ass is freaking <laughs> blocked the whole thing. I think it was you. It wasn't, I swear. So, what's the joke? Um, just something somebody wrote. Who? Oh, no, no. Uh, just something that was written in the ladies' room wall. What is it? Who wrote it? Um, it's kind of private. It's about Michael. <laughs> that is defacement of company property. So you better tell me. Dwight's such a nerd. Uh, if you tell me, you'll be punished less. Okay, now I'm laughing at you. <laughs> Will Her Highness Jan Levinson Gould be descending from her corporate throne this evening to visit us lowly serfs here at Dunder Mifflin Scranton? It's a, it's, it's a two and a half hour drive from New York, Michael. Well, you could take the bus. You could take a bus. Here, sleep on the way home. No. This is important. I mean, this is, this is validation to my employees here that you and corporate approve of this. So but we don't. <laughs> I love Steve Carell's face. It's so fucking priceless. Um. <laughs> by the footage. This little character I like to do. Oh my is, god. Uh, loosely based on Karnak, one of Carson's classic characters. Name three businesses that have better health care plans than Dunder Mifflin. <laughs> Here's the problem. <laughs> There's no open bar because of Jan. And it's the reason why oh, comedy man. clubs have a two drink minimum. I mean, it'll be fine. I just wish people were gonna be drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh no, he's going to the ladies' bathroom. He's going to catch him in there. Oh my God, Phyllis! <laughs> he said, "What were you doing in there?" Engagement. <laughs> Excuse me, everyone. Can I have your attention, please? I just wanted to say that the women in this office are terrible, especially the ones who wrote that stuff about Michael on the bathroom wall. Having a bathroom is a privilege. It is called a <laughs> ladies' room for a reason. And if you cannot behave, having ladies, a bathroom is a privilege. Well, that's fucked. You are not going to have a bathroom. You're taking away our bathroom, uh, Michael. Yes. Why it's banning us from our bathroom? Okay, well that's ridiculous. So just don't. I, I don't well, have time for this right no, now. There needs to be repercussions just for don't, people's don't behavior. Talk, don't talk. Don't touch. Stop yelling! <laughs> okay. Look, I know there have been a lot of rumors <laughs> flying around about the Dundies this year. Fucking Dwight, he's a trip. Going oh, to Chili's. Welcome to the eighth annual Dundies Awards. Before we get started, a few announcements. Keep your acceptance. I know he's not trying to make announcements in that loud ass family restaurant. Uh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the Dundies are kind of like a kid's birthday party. Steve Carell dropping bars. You know, and there's really nothing for you to do. Yeah. Greg Robinson, all right. Um, guys, where are you going? Just, uh, Pam, the show's just getting started. Damn. Uh, uh, and now, awkward. Goes quiet. Way to go, Phyllis. Nice work. Per usual. This says bushiest beaver. Oh, no. <laughs> Jim looking at the camera. <laughs> we'll, fix it. we'll fix it up. You don't have to display that. Because that's what happens He's a every, every year. Come on, no. go in the porridge. No, I don't want to. Oh, shit. If you would have asked me that, then you would know. Now we're all going to break by me. Damn. You know? Hey. She just took his beer, like he wasn't gonna notice. Oh no! Oh no! With the Asian sitting behind him. Ryan the temp. Ryan the temp. Sex thing. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There you go. Woo! He did not smack him on the behind. <laughs> and the tight ass award goes to Angela. Not only because she is everybody's favorite stickler, but because she has a great caboose. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he is OD right now. Spicy curry award goes to our very own wasn't even funny. Kapoor. The spicy curry award. <laughs> How on earth? Spicy curry, what's that mean? Um, not everything means something. It's just a joke. Yeah, but why'd you give it to me? I don't know. I, just, I don't know. <laughs> it's, it's, I know. It's just, they didn't have any more businessmen. So yeah, but just sit else. down, Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> just sit the fuck down. Hey, where are you guys from? Oh just no. From your mama's house. Are you guys gonna oh. that? Damn, that's disrespectful. Oh, yeah. Damn, what on earth? Uh, you know what, guys? We're just having a. Little office party, so if you want them, hey, you know, cool it, guys. Really, oh, shit. suck, man. Suck. Oh, that's fucked up. Oh, man. I think those of you who listened, <clears throat> this last Sunday is for Kevin. This is the Don't Go In There After Me Award. It's for the time that I went to the bathroom after him and it was really, really smelly. <laughs> Damn. Damn, Kev. Damn. Yay, Kevin! I'm paying for drunk ass. Oh, that was nice of him. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. All that was right. nice. Was, Mike was going through it. Fine work award. This goes to Stanley for all the fine work he did this year. Yeah. All right, Stanley. So I don't. 
So I don't know what to think about this. All right, Pam, calm down. Oh, Jesus. But at least I didn't get smelliest bowel movement like Kevin. <laughs> smelliest bowel movement. That's so good. And this next award is going out to our own little Pam Beasley. I think we all know what award Pam is going to be getting this year. It is the Whitest Sneakers Award. The Whitest she Sneakers Award. Tennis shoes on. And she's drunk as fuck, man. She, if he just said longest engagement again, he'd have lost it. <laughs> oh my god, she is gone. Okay, first off, my kids. Because my kids. Them. You even make those anymore? Anybody I still wear kids? So, finally, I want to thank God because God gave me this Dundee. <laughs> and She's making like an Oscar acceptance speech. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> What? Oh. Everybody saw that, right? What a great year. Look at him like, uh. He heard look at her, look at him like he is song. Which for me a featured menu really item. Nothing. Okay. Nothing my ass. What? I don't know. What? You're gonna have to wipe that wipe that seat down oh if you know what we oh. You are Damn. So <laughs> Did you get that? Please tell Sheesh. me you got this is all gonna be on. Woman is that something to cushion her head? Throw a pillow, a cushion. Okay, what is he doing taking his shirt off? Oh, sorry, sir, you're gonna have to put your clothes We have a strict policy here not to overserve. Apparently, this young woman was sneaking drinks off other people's tables. I Xerox her driver's license, and she is not welcome at this restaurant chain ever again. <laughs> they banned her ass from Chili's. Yes, that too, but I mean, with the audio. Great, great work. Oh, what a feel good moment. Good. Um, this one started off a little dry, uh, probably just cause it's the beginning of the season episode, but the part with the actual Dundies, hilarious. I like that. Uh, I like that they all give Michael Scott a hard time like during the office, but like when it counts in the episodes, they hit you with like the, the feel good moments. Like as much as he drives them all crazy, they all, uh, they see when he gets upset, like when he was about to call it quits at the Dundies. And then they all started cheering him on and everything like that. That's always nice to see there. And then how about Pam? Man, Pam just <laughs> off the liquor. Holy cow. That's a common thing with people though. And uh, I think that's relatable with a lot of people. They, um, you know, aspects in their life stress them out. The liquor helps them open up to people, people they trust and you know, true feelings come, come out. You know, it's not always the same situation where they're with someone and they want to be with someone else, but whether it be, you know, just expressing yourself to someone you trust about, you know, just the shit you got on your mind or anything. That's why they call it liquid courage. It, uh, it helps you get it all out. But this is a good way to kick off season two. Really funny. Pam got banned from Chili's. That was hilarious. The, uh, <laughs> the, uh, the smelliest be uh, bowel movement award, I think Stanley called it for Kevin. That shit was funny. <laughs> it's funny, like Michael Scott is just so full of himself. He, uh, you know, he, he puts on this big show at a, at a Chili's, like it's the Oscars. He, uh, he's making his own versions of songs like OPP and like Tiny Dancer by Elton John. And uh, <laughs> it's just, it, it's really, it, they do a good job. It's really funny. It, it's just great. It's like, it's like a show being recorded inside of a show, which is interesting about The Office. So it's like you have the, the office as a whole, the show, and then you have like the camera crew in the show following everybody around. And it's to me, it's so hilarious when when um, when controversial things are said or when off like off things are said by Michael Scott because he just lets it go, which is great. And then when he says things and it pans to people and they're looking like, like, you know what I mean? They have like an awkward like, what the fuck? Kind of face yeah they do a great job on the show um i can't wait to do season two or excuse me episode two of season two for you guys but that's gonna wrap it up for this video let me know what you thought of this episode down in the comments below make sure you hit that like button and you're subscribed to the channel down below and turn on those notifications so you're notified when i post new content that's gonna wrap it up for this video guys i'll catch you on the next one take it easy